So your second part of your playing um, assignment today for March 16th is Avenger, the beginning to 16. So the very first thing that we're going to do is actually write in some dynamic volumes because there's a lot of dynamic contrast in these 10 measures. So in measure one, you'll write in a volume seven. This crescendos into volume into um, volume nine in measure four, where you have an FF for fortissimo. Measure four will be volume nine at the fortissimo. Then one measure later, it's going to go to a volume five. So that mezzo forte will be much quieter than the fortissimo the measure before. Measure five, volume five. Then in measure seven and eight, you will crescendo from a seven to an eight to a nine in measure nine. So just the measure numbers. Measure one is a volume seven. Measure four is a volume nine. Measure five is a volume five. Measure seven is a seven. Eight is an eight and nine is a nine. Kind of funny how those worked out. Something to note, alto saxophones, French horns, trombones, baritones, two, not tubas, but saxophones, tenor saxophones, not bass clarinet or berry though. You have a really neat rhythm in measure six. Measure six sounds like this. One, two, ready, go. One and two and, and four and. That's measure six. One and two and, and four and. So as you're working on the beginning to measure 10, make sure you're watching measure six for that group of people. Have a good day, have fun practicing.